Hey guys, back with another video with K fishing with Kaya. And um today we're gonna be uh, oh I am gonna be sharing you how to do a surf casting setup at an NZ. One of the easiest one, easiest ways how to do it. And uh yeah, let's get right into it. So what you need first is you'll need three snap saws, I think. I think it's three. Yeah, I think. So three snap saws, one sand grab, um, 40 tough trace, um, black magic leader, yeah. Some of that. Yeah. Um, um, I think that's a four bar row. Hook and a, or a curved hook, and then it's a five bar row curved hook. These are just the hooks that I'm using. I don't know if you want to use smaller or bigger, but anyway, grab your grab your tough trace leader, roll it out about that much bam bam go with scissors if you got some or clippers snippers or clippers got that line boom boom just that bit right there grab your little saw oh yeah not little but just the saw chuck it on this this one that one and then do a uni knot I think it's called a uni I'm not sure do it about eight times oh, bam. Yeah, and nothing. bam tighten it up Blam. Chip off the tag in a little bit. If it's a bit long, we'll show you. Blam. Boom. Boom. That much tag in. Or, and maybe grab a lighter. Light that bit up. Just a little bit, tap it with your finger, make it a bit flat so it doesn't slide off. And then grab your sand grabber right here, chuck it in there, boom, put it on. And then you got that bit there, or blam blam. And I, I made this in the other video before if you want to see that it's right here flam get that off of this video it's how to make a straight line and i use a straight line for surf casting too it's a very good one for snappers because always fish for snappers or car lines trevellies you can get these on trevellies and snappers and all those all kinds of fish and then Get your sand grabber and then your hooks and then put your sand grabber on what one was it? That one right there. This one on the top of this. Tie it on, uni knot, might be able to be tied up. But yeah, check it on Down right there, I don't know if you can see that. Oh no, you can't. I'll just show you after this. Tie in and out eight times. Two, three, four. Oh no, four. Five, six, seven, eight. 
and I'm going to do a video about a unit up soon, very soon, not very soon, but soon. Turn it on. Bam! So you got that one. This is one. So I'll just be flinging around the hook. Just fling around the place over there, and this will be sand grabbing the ground right there. This will be just flying around in the current at the beach. And then, next one, grab your your um, line on your fishing rod. I've got my fishing rod hooked up. I'll use braid for mine. And um, you need to grab that, grab a snap swivel. I got my own box from hunting and fishing, 20 bucks. Good treat. Treat. Good treat. And then put it on this one right here. Tie it on, you know, again. No, you see any knots for everything. Every single knot. One, maybe eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. I'll just do one more time because I think it's not enough. Boom. Put it on. Bam, bam. And I recommend this is the easiest way to do a to do a surf casting setup so I recommend if you don't recommend then key is not a key but I bet you those Maoris out there right you use this one you use these ones these are just uh, the normal ones that the Maoris do and that's the Pakyas do Hard to check down. Put the put the end off a little bit. It's pretty tight. Put that, put that. Oh no, I did it the wrong way. But who cares? It wasn't supposed to go this way. The one on the fishing rod, it was supposed to go on. On that one, it was supposed to be four swivels, but you do that. And uh, you just chuck it on. We'll blam. We'll flam. And we'll blam. You got your serif casting set up already. Let's go. Let's go to the beach boy. And uh, yeah. Please subscribe. Like the video. And I'll see you in another video very, very soon. About the Union or something else. Alright. You doggies. Know,